going to be following the migration of the osprey. So there's various big flight routes around the world and there's one that goes between Europe and Africa and the osprey is one of those birds. So at the moment there's about 400,000 people around the country watching osprey cameras on nests as wow. yeah, watching how the young fare and what we want to do is actually look at how they're going to uh, go on their journey back to Africa because when the young birds migrate they do it on their own for the first time. They also have to learn to fish for themselves for the first time on migration but we know 70% never make it back. Uh, so that's what we want to find out. And why should we care about the osprey, Joanne oh, Lambie? They sound fascinating. They're, they're but... the top of the food chain. They're like the canary in the coal mine because if, if the osprey goes, the osprey is... It's, it's the symbol of actually life on Earth, it's, mm. and that's not putting it too boldly. It's terribly important that we see... Sasha would have been flying with them. She's called the human swan because she flew with the Buick mm. swans, wow. also an endangered migratory species. But this time, the, she's sending drones up, but the team is following it. And we've got to see what, where the world's going wrong for these, these birds and mammals and fish and everything that belongs to the Earth as much as we do. Mm. So you should be able to see where the wetlands are drying up, where the rivers are what kind of plastic pollution is in the oceans, but yeah. also the countries that are able to sustain these and the good things that are going to happen. We've got to follow these birds, which are, from me to you, Ben, the wingspan is absolutely mm. huge, awesome. 